Hey guys, on our way to church. Um, I got up this morning and practiced one new song. First song, it's a new one. Oh great, gotta set up the, all the settings for a new song. But. Yep, it's good, it's all good. I didn't record today, but I will probably set up my phone to record the music as we do it in church maybe, or maybe I'll do it later or something, I don't know. Let's turn you guys around and see what the lake looks like. It's frozen. We were coming home last night. And, oh, lots of people out there. We were coming home last. There's somebody with their snowmobile and it looks like they snowmobiled out to fish. We were coming home last night. It was dark and there was lots of snowmobiles on the lake. Anyway, roads are pretty good. Gas is $1.949, which is $1.95. Last night when we were at Walmart, it was $1.939, which is $1.94. And uh, lots of snowmobilers up here this weekend because everybody's happy that we finally got s some good snow. I don't know if you can tell on the sides of the roads, there's snowmobile tracks up and down because that's everybody just travels by snowmobile. Not everybody. We don't, do we, dear? Not anymore, yeah. Pete used to quite a bit. I, I've i been on other people's snowmobiles back when I was in college, but not since. But you have snowmobile tracks all up and down the road, because that's how, that's how everybody travels. Another shot of the lake. There's a shot of my Petey. Whoa. Who's driving, obviously. Snow, there's snowmobiles on the back of that truck. Yeah, I love this whole snowmobile thing. If I, if we were in a position to have snowmobiles and pay for that and the insurance and the gas and all that stuff, we would have snowmobiles. We I mean, wouldn't go zooming around like everybody does because I don't think either of us, our bones could take it, but we'd have snowmobiles, wouldn't we? The bones would be the biggest thing. Yeah, the bones would be the biggest thing, but we'd have snowmobiles. Maybe after church we will go... Um, and look at Shantytown. They got the shanties out last Sunday. When Pete found out when they were putting them out because I had every intention of going and recording them, pulling the shanties out and making, creating Shantytown. But um, as you know, I was way too sick. Yeah, I was too sick. And then I went, then we went down in, um, to Mount Pleasant. But then I crashed for the next two days. But it was worth it. We needed groceries anyway. So that's that's it for right now. Hobbit 3 is showing at the Pines, in case I didn't mention that. And uh, I'll turn you guys off, and then later after church, I'll show you. Uh, we'll show you Shantytown, and that's where we'll be going out to walk and stuff. I'm not dressed for it at the moment, but we probably will be going out soon. Tomorrow's supposed to be bitterly cold, so possibly this afternoon, but it just depends. So I'll talk to you guys later. Bye. Again. Hey guys, guess where we are? Hi Petey. I thought the camera was turned around. Just a minute. Yeah, guess where we are? Will you hold this please while I put my glove back on? Am I recording? Yeah. First time this year. It was a spur of the moment thing. No, I'm not dressed for it, but Pete had a spare scarf I put on my head. I got my gloves and since this will be the first time we're not gonna be walking all the way out there to Shantytown anyway. Let's see where Shantytown is. <clears throat> we'll just go out a little bit and record a little bit. The lake in the winter time <clears throat> is like its whole own little cosmos. <coughs> Thank you. Oh, I think a piece of fuzz. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Stop it. <laughs> Stop. Can you hold that, please? Oh! <laughs>
Yeah. for one sake. Yeah. I had a piece of fuzz in my mouth. Look how pretty that sky is. Of course, I can't get fuzz out of my mouth when I'm wearing these fuzzy. Here we are. We're walking in the road, as you can see. Hope you can, because I can't. It's so bright. Oh, yeah, there's some open water. <laughs> you want to walk over there, Pete? <laughs> no. It's not open. It's just a puddle on top of the ice. Really rough under there. Cool. Yeah, nice big crack. Remember that orange um, lighthouse from last year? That orange building there from last year? Oh, they were out here. Uh-oh, traffic. Yeah, I think he's got the right eye. You think? I still wonder who the first person was that decided that they could make a snowmobile by taking a chainsaw <laughs> and hooking it into a box and put some sleds <laughs> up front. <laughs> Oh, he's turning around. Oh. Anyway. Bye. There's a guy we saw with the uh, mule going out. He's got a like a tent type shanty going up over there. I don't have you guys zoomed in so that you can see what we can see. See. Oh, not that far. Yeah, that's about what I see. Anyway, how far are we from shore? Not very. Last year we walk all the way out to Shanty Town and back, but I don't think I'm up for it yet. I'm starting to get short of breath already. <laughs> of course, I'm still a little sinusy and stuff, too. Hey, we're walking on water. Yeah. Anyway, this is as far as I'm going. I'm starting to get too short of breath. Okay. There's Pete. We're right in the snowmobile lane of traffic here. He's got the whole lane. <laughs> it does steer, you know. <laughs> here comes some more over there. There's more coming. Um, anyway. Yeah, I can't believe the east end of the lake is still wide open water. This is a huge lake though, so it's not like we have to worry about it over here. He's coming right at us. He's got coming for us. We're surrounded on all sides. Turn around again, wimp. All right, let's turn around because I still got to walk back into the wind. <laughs> but you guys will be so tired of seeing us out here walking by the time winter's done because we just love it. It'd be cool if we could walk all the way across by spring. I don't think we could do it. <laughs> You'd walk halfway across and swim the rest of the way. <laughs> <laughs> it's pretty windy, so I'm going to put this away. Hi guys, just finished dinner, getting dinner ready. There's our cabbage, bacon, and onions. And there's our fried pork chops. And in this pan, Carrots and daikons with butter and herbs. 
So today was a great day, obviously. We went out on the lake. First time this season. So excited, so thrilled, so happy. Can't wait to get back out there. It's supposed to be bitterly cold, wind chills below zero again the next couple days. So it probably won't be the next couple days, but I can't wait to get back. Um, let's see. I did not record any music today because I didn't have time in the morning. So I thought, well, I'll record our singing at church. And then I forgot to turn it on before I went up there. So I didn't record that. And we had a, a guest, um, a guest, a speaker from the Gideons, and he always does a great message. But I recorded it, but um, but it's not something that I feel you know necessarily I want to go through the whole message and pick out a piece to share. So I'm not going to. Hey, that's it for today. So I hope everybody has a marvelous Monday. I hope you all had a great weekend and got plenty rested. Or plenty accomplished or plenty of fun or whatever you use your weekends for and I will see you tomorrow take care God bless and good night